Best Exit Lag Lost Arc Knowing the best exit lag settings for Lost Arc optimizes network performance, reduces latency, and ensures smoother gameplay, enhancing your overall gaming experience and performance in the game. Now, if that is what you are up to, then go ahead and follow this instruction. Now, say for example, you have done all the optimization that you can do in Lost Arc itself in order for you to have a lag-free gaming but still doesn't work. Now, here's another thing that you can do. Basically, you're just going to go ahead and look for it in Google all right here you're just going to go ahead and type exit lag so exit lag ensures better and faster connection routes to game servers eliminating connection issues with a single button press and if that is tempting to you then go ahead and click this free trial in here so here's a free trial what you're going to do is basically fill in all the informations needed and take note it doesn't require your credit card or any card for that matter. So just go ahead and fill in all the information needed here in order for you to get three days worth of free trial. Now go ahead and try it and once you're done creating your own account, go ahead and hit the download button in here. Now from this point forward, you're just going to go ahead and click download exit lag. It is going to look like this. So go ahead and try it. So yep, say for example, in my case, this is how it looks. Now what you're going to do here is basically turn it on first, just like so. And then you're going to go ahead and look for Lost Ark. Now there are different servers here for Lost Ark, so go ahead and choose yours. For example, in my case, I'm going to go ahead and choose this one here. Now go ahead and click this and you're going to go ahead and manually select your region from this point forward. Now there are also others here, for example, there you go. So this is Beijing, Hong Kong, Shanghai. We we have this one here this is i think for korea and we have for russia and this is also for asia or taiwan so you can go ahead and select yours say for example this is mine i'm just going to go ahead and click this one here and then you'll have to manually select it so say for example sao paulo i'm going to go ahead and choose the first one there you go now from this point forward i'm just going to go ahead and click use the routes within my country first and then go ahead and hit advanced routes now majority of gameplay actually uses UDP so make sure that you're going to put the two here as well so go ahead and click apply once you're done all right now this is something that I'm going to show you and this is actually very interesting as you can see I am from this particular place here Manila and then this is also from Sao Paulo Brazil but if I were to change this one I'm going to go ahead and show you there you go you can see it changed as well right meaning it is working so that is how great this is say for example if i were to choose for example this one this is asian server if i were to click this one here and manually select asia or maybe taiwan all right just like so you can see that it looks a bit different right so let's try it all right there you go now you can see it working meaning it is doing its job for you but then again, let's go back here. We're going to go ahead and click Sao Paulo and then advanced routes. Make sure that the UDP is 2 as well. Apply. All right. Now, from this point forward, what you are going to do is basically hit apply routes. And also, this is something that I'm going to show you. As you can see, there is an estimated ping in here. So this is the estimate that you're going to get. Um, 311 is not very ideal. So let's try to do, uh, okay, disable this one here. All right, there you go. So after trying to check which game region I'm going to use, you can see that now I have settled to US Seattle too. And you can see that the estimated ping has dropped 50%. So that's really amazing. Now, from this point forward, you can just go ahead and hit apply routes and now you are ready to go. So from this point forward, I want you to go ahead and open your Lost Ark game. And then you can go ahead and have an unforgettable gaming experience. So yeah, congratulations everybody, that is the best exit lag settings for Lost Ark. And if you are interested in using exit lag, go ahead and click the link in the description box or the comment section for you to start with your 3 days of free trial. As always, don't forget to subscribe to the channel and leave this video a like if it helps you out.